Tommy, two goals for you today, four goals for the Leverhead twice this week. Talk to us about today's performance, mate. I thought it was a great team performance. We we knew what we had to do. We went out, we done it, we played well, we worked hard and uh, two goals to top it off, so good. We spoke after Tuesday about how off the ball we, we really impressed and, and on the ball we needed to be better. How much better were we on the ball today? Oh, so much better. I think on Tuesday, we we were good, we were all right, but it wasn't up to the levels. Today, I think we showed what we can do on the ball. Um, but yeah, we need to maintain that now. That's the standards we set, so we just need to keep that up now. So it's a couple of weeks since we last had a chat, me and you. Um, how do you feel you're settling in now to the gaffer system and, and how it suits you? Yeah, I think it suits me very well because I like to get on the ball. I like to come in short and with our tens running in behind, it's, it's working really well. Um, and the boys have been welcoming, so I'm really enjoying it here. You mentioned the tens there. Um, can we have a word from you about Dan Hector and, and Trey today? Yeah, they're, they're just they're so good to play with because they're always on the move. They, they know if I'm going in, they're going out. They, they just know and I'm starting to build that relationship up with them, which is good. Fantastic. So um, we go up into a big game on Tuesday night against Bad Shotley. Um, what are the biggest things we can take out from today? I think we just need to do the same, same mentality, go out, do the same and just win again. Just need to keep winning, keep getting the points on the board. So we, we know we scored four goals today. We scored four goals on Tuesday night. Um, but however, two clean sheets is, is probably the most sort of satisfying thing about that. How important is it to keep clean sheets? It's so important because um, it shows that we're not just scoring the goals. It shows that we're defending our box as well. Because if you don't defend your box first, then like, you're not going to win. It's, that's that, that comes first. And how good were them boys at the back today? I'm <laughs> real. Nothing got past them all day. They were solid. Nothing got past them. And then if anything does, we've got, we've got Mike Allen in the sticks there <laughs> for a young lad who's, who's really shown his quality this week, hasn't he? Yeah. No, just honestly, he's <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> so, Staggy, we, we rest and recover now uh, ahead of Tuesday. Yeah. Um, how important of a game is Tuesday for us? It's massive. We, we've... After the defeat of Marlow, we've shown that we can come out and do it again twice. Now we need to do it again for the third time, make a statement. Brilliant. You mentioned Marlow there. Um, it's still sort of a, a result that, that hurts us. Um, but how well do you think the boys have reacted from there? So we've, you know, a goal difference of eight since we played Marlow. Two clean sheets. How good is that as a, as a bounce back? You can't, you can't ask for better than that. I just think we need to keep doing it consistently now. Like we know the Milo game, we had a bad day in the office, it happens, it's football, but we need to go out and keep getting points, keep winning and keeping it up now. We've set the standard, so we need to hit. Brilliant. And Staggy, the last word from you. Um, how important is it when you had a little look round today, um, which probably 85% Leverett fans here once yeah. again, um, it seems to happen for a lot of our away games and it's yeah. so important that, that these guys keep turning out for us. How important is it for you on the pitch to see all sort of the green scarves around the pitch? Oh, 100%. We, we need them here every game, supporting the boys because they're, they're a part of us as well. So we need them here cheering us on and I feel like it helps us, gives us a buzz because we need to keep winning. So have you got a message for them Leatherhead fans ahead of, to, of Tuesday's match against Badshot? Just hopefully get as many of you down again. Keep supporting the boys because it's, it's brilliant. We need to keep it up now. You heard it, Leatherhead fans. So Tuesday night, back at the Grove. Hopefully another fantastic fourth performance from Leatherhead. Staggy, excellent today, young man. Well done. Thank you. Cheers. Thanks.